at Dirt King, bringing her in. It'll be the last time she's bone stock like this. A few moments later. Getting my truck today from Dirt King. You, let's go baby. Not too shabby. Oh my God. It's a nice sunny California day and I'm gonna show you all the new updates I have on my Toyota Tacoma with the GoFast camper. Uh, first thing I did, I'll start with the front right here. I got a Toyota TRD Pro grill. Just love the way that looks. I'm not a big cosmetic person, but I just really the only thing that's really awesome looking is that front grill. Um, there is a garnish piece that's supposed to go right here that I forgot to get. So I'm going to have that soon. I already ordered that piece and I'll install that. That way the cruise control and all that stuff will continue to work. Uh, the plan was to put a light bar on right here. Um, I took the truck to Dirt King and they were going to do be able to install that for me, but they didn't have that part in stock. So I'll just do that sometime down the road. But I was able to also install these amber LED fog lights on the front of the truck. Just kind of gives a nice look. The specific LED light is going to be Baja Designs, by the way. I took the truck to Dirt King down in San Diego and the entire thing took about um, two days to fully get done. And they did everything from installing everything I wanted to get done to, uh, you know, aligning the wheels, tires, everything like that. What I ended up getting on the wheels and tire setup, I got BF Goodrich KO2s, um, they're 33s, but really like 32 and a half inch tires. And then the wheels I went with are 16 inch um, by eight inch black Rhino chamber wheels with a negative 15 millimeter offset. Um, really kind of looks nice. I think it just slightly sticks out and it gives it just that nice aggressive stance that I really like on the truck. Now under here, what I had done, and you can kind of see what that all looks like on the inside there. So I got Fox shocks, uh, two and a half inch mid travel kit, and then I got an upper control arm, um, all Dirt King. They did a great job. And then they did a little bit of shaving. Uh, they did a little body mount shave uh, right down here. You can kind of see uh, just to make sure that the tire doesn't rub. And what's really nice about the body mount shave that they did, it doesn't void the factory warranty of your truck. And then same setup kind of in the rear, um, obviously, you know, Fox shocks. Something that I had put on here is gonna be Deaver leaf springs, a little bit heavier. It's gonna be the, there they are. It's rated for um, three to 600 pounds extra on the, on the rear than factory, I believe. So with the go fast camper weighing about 260 pounds and then all the gear back there will be another you know, like 200 pounds or so, give or take. Um, that'll be right on, right on track for what it needs to be lifting. Uh, one of my favorite upgrades I did was a mountain hatch. I got a tailgate essentially cutting board. So, you know, the original Tacomas, it's kind of like that wavy tailgate. So this is a nice flat piece. Uh, it's super nice to have the tailgate down, just rest on it. It feels good on the butt. So you don't have to worry about being uncomfortable when you're sitting there, but made in the USA and it's got a food grade plastic material on here. So you can use it as a cutting board when you guys are camping. Um, really just wanted that on the truck. Thought it'd be a lot nicer to have that. And then I'm just gonna kind of read off the list of the exact parts I got on my truck. If you guys like the way it looks, um, great. You know, you can just copy this directly. I'll probably even um, have pictures of my truck up on the Dirt King website. Cause I, norm I know they normally do that with their builds. So um, front and rear Fox 2.5 shocks. Uh, Deaver U402 springs um, and then obviously a double shear kit I put on on the truck uh, alignment I also did a power brake 
install. I forgot to mention that. So it's a Forerunner Toyota Z36 truck and tow brake kit. That's what I had installed. I wanted to get a bigger Willwood brake kit, but they don't fit on 16 inch rims. So if you wanted to do a bigger brake kit, you'd have to have at least 17 inch rims. I wish I knew that before I bought the rims I have, but I do like the bigger, fatter tire look on the truck. Um, and then body mount chop and trimming for the 33 inch tires. Um, and then obviously Baja Designs Amber Fog Light Kit, um, tailgate panel, TRD Pro Grill. Dirt King just threw that in for me for free. I've looked into getting maybe like more of an overland kind of build rear bumper and maybe something up on the front. But to be honest with you, I don't do anything super crazy or aggressive. I just like to kind of cruise down desert roads at a quick pace and uh, maybe do a little bit of off-roading here and there, but I really didn't want to chop anything and, and slap on anything too aggressive. I definitely don't want to void the warranty until it's, that's at least done with. As far as things go on the inside of the Go Fast Camper, um, I'm also having a drawer system being built to fit inside of here. It's just going to be a couple large drawers coming in and out. That way I'll be able to kind of um, take out these massive boxes I have and I usually have a couple other things like some chairs in here a couple other boxes for like camping materials I got some Westcott Designs rock sliders so I'll be taking off these factory you know running boards and I'll have the slight slanted up ones just the tubed Westcott Designs it'll look pretty nice pretty aggressive and it just won't be so low sitting um, I think it'll look a little bit cleaner on the truck. Something I really want to put on the truck um, that's going to be on there pretty soon, just a PA system, something I got off of Amazon, pretty basic. I just really want something to be able to kind of like have a little alarm, be able to talk to people. I think a PA system is kind of fun. And then another thing I'm looking to get done on the truck is... I'm looking to make sure I have some sort of like ram mount, some sort of like bracket thing. I'd like something to maybe mount kind of up top here, maybe like a little rail system so I can throw some stuff up here. Something I can mount my phone on pretty easily. I don't specifically know what I'd want to get, but let me know um, if you guys have any recommendations. That'd be great. So far, everything's been pretty sweet with the truck. Um, I think, and I kind of forget now what I was initially getting when I got the truck. When it's a it's a 2023 Tacoma, I just passed the year mark. I bought it March 16th of 2023, so it's been a year, and I currently just crested over 38,000 miles. So 38,000 like 200 miles is what I have on the truck. Um, I think when I first got it, it was getting right around like the 22 MPG mark. Uh, when I put on the Go Fast Camper, um, it was right around like 17 and a half. 17.9 mpg so it knocked it down a few just with you know the wind resistance and then with the 33 inch tires um and the go fast camper installed on it uh it's gonna be i think i saw it just the other day it's 13.8 is kind of what i'm getting so 13.8 um if i'm kind of going down to san diego it's like 14.4 14.5 but it's gonna be sub 15 mpg uh not super great but just kind of everything I got done to the truck. Uh, so far, truck drives awesome. Um, the suspension really helps with just even little random potholes and bumps that you even hit. Um, and then for sure, when I do my first off-roading trip with it, it'll be pretty cool. I'm excited to see what that looks like. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much everything on the Go Fast Camper and kind of truck update. Um, and yeah, appreciate the guys over at Dirt King. If you guys are ever looking to get something done with your truck, uh, definitely check them out.